<clears throat> and you know, there's plenty of stuff going on in the market as we go on hour by hour. You know, it's very volatile and you and um crypto nation you, you um you all have to take consideration on how how fast this this kind of market moves. All right. In in traditional markets, the stock market is seen slight down at 0.59%. That's with the NASDAQ. The CBOE volatility index, on the other hand, has gained a solid 6.51% on the day at press time. Earlier today, CNBC reported that the news stock market was seen at open, pointing the fact that investors are waiting for information on a potential trade deal between the US and China. All right, and um where I'm getting this information is from one of my um, favorite favorite websites for cryptocurrency news. It's called Cointelegraph.com, and I highly recommend that you go check them out. They give some pretty good information about cryptos and also stock markets. So don't forget to head over to their page and and dissect and see what you find for yourself. And maybe you might find something else a little bit more interesting than what I'm producing. And that might give you an idea to start your own podcast or podcast episode. And uh, I would love to hear it and and uh, get my feedback on what I think about what you're producing. <clears throat> All right. Earlier today, I'm sorry. Major oil futures and indexes are in red with I are um, with WTI crude down 1.63%, Brent crude down 0.68, and Mars US down 0.21%. OPEX basket is also down 0.7% and the Canadian crude index has seen its value decrease by 1.16% according to oil prices. All right. So there's a lot of stuff going on in the news about the stock market and cryptocurrencies. And I'm pretty sure everybody's super excited about what's going on you know even with even with um news like this is still the snowball effect is still taking place and and there's plenty of plenty of momentum kicking kicking into gear and you know we're we're trying to hit a good solid bullet bull run this this crypto trading season and um, during this quick market trend there really hasn't been much going on you know it's been pretty stable not a lot of volatility really like to be noticing like tremendously but it's on it's on the uprise and that's that's a good sign and uh you know for a while there it was going up one month and then down another month and then just kept going like that. But there's there's plenty of potential for other things. And you know, all there is, there's just more room to grow and more news that needs to be shared with, with the blockchain technology and the crypto world. And you know, there's, there's so much to still be learning 
like I've said, repetition, repetition. And, you know, it, it matters how much you take in for yourself to see where, where this is uh, taking, taking us for future generations. You know, and um, I'm going to, Bitcoin, they say people are going to be the, Bitcoin, they say Bitcoin is going to be the king for a while. And that can be true that, that more than likely is going to be around for the years to come. But to be honest with you, I'm really waiting for someone to really stand toe to toe with, with Bitcoin. Um, Ethereum is a possibility and XRP can be a possibility in my opinion you know I'm not, I'm not an expert but it's just the way I see it on the charts right now you know the price differences are 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 separated you know far from each other but you know there's always more room to to um, gain in and Ethereum is getting more and more popular. It's cheaper right now. For those of you who are new to my channel, Ethereum would be the safest um, investment to make, in my opinion. And in XRP too. And uh, you know, I want to throw a little bit of a bonus too with uh, Engine Coin. Just came out with some brand new news. And uh, they're teaming up. They're, they've teamed up with a quite known uh, game industry, and they're going to be using their blockchain technology to start producing games. And that's huge in the community of gamers, and they are excited. Uh, my roommate let me told me right when he got the email update about it, and this happened a, a couple days. Uh, earlier and I was just waiting to see and it's really it really has been blowing up just seeing youtubers and podcasters and bloggers write write about engine coin is phenomenal and I'm super excited about where that project's going my my roommate's just like haha I told you so you should have listened to me and I'm sorry but it's it was the way I was feeling but you know I still have a lot of coins with engine and and uh, looking for that big that that nice little push up to forty cents, hopefully. And we're talking some some good gains and and profits. Where I'll really be making some money is that is when when they hit like five dollars, then I'll be happy. I'll be really happy. Actually, I'll be super happy. You know, that'll give me a little bit of room to breathe and and enjoy life and and use that money in a positive way to help contribute to my podcast channel and my youtube channel so it's going to be great stuff i still have plenty of other coins that i'm invested into like tron and xrp and uh xlm stiller and ADA. So just waiting for those coins to start making a real good push up and and then we'll be in business and then it'll be like, oh I told you so. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But you know it's it's not about the the bragging rights. It's about the 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 snowball effect and the momentum that cryptocurrency is gaining in uh, blockchain technology. And it's just a matter of time. Um, I'm just waiting. And the longer I wait, the more and more it gets popular. And and it's going to be famous one of these days. Pretty soon, rappers are going to be singing about cryptocurrency instead of money. And and it's it's pretty cool. The way that that the new generation is going to work and how they they're going to be forced to to apply digital assets to their to to their financial system most importantly and you know i was uh 
messing around on Instagram and and one of the users asked um, me to tell her something that she's never heard of before. And I was like, digital asset is gonna take over the paper dollar. And she said, I highly doubt that I like, I like uh, paper too much. And that was quite funny, you know, how the person didn't have the idea of the future and the opportunity ahead and just being blind to what the what the potential success that this this technology is going to have most importantly and that's about it crypto nation uh, i hope you i hope you all enjoyed the show and uh please give some likes that goes a long way more than you know and if you're listening on anchor feel free to call in don't forget i'm available on spotify apple podcast google podcast android podcast and many many more that anchor teams up with and it's pretty cool how they allow me to use their app to connect with more diverse diverse um radio stations and podcasts on, on another level of apps so give a like give a share tell your friends get involved with community share it in your groups and have a good one guys and girls Stabilizing surge.